All right, this tutorial is going to be about I3, as you can see. We are on Arch Labs, activated I3, we logged first out of Openbox, went to the top right, chose our desktop and said, I want to have I3. And if by chance you arrived at I3 by accident, super, X is the one that gets you out in both uh, environments. Super X tells you to log out or suspend down here at the bottom. So you can do that. This tutorial is not going to be about single dual screen. I've just made the tutorial, so you check that out. I just wanted to show and um, people will maybe um, want to get rid of the borders or the borders too thick and things like that. So this is about borders and this gap. Let's take another wallpaper so you see. Well, that's a light wallpaper. Let's have a look at what's behind here. Oh no, you don't stay. All T, all T, trash for variety. Uh, one of the most uh, beautiful ones for me at the moment. Let's leave this one. Um, so we are gonna, oh yeah, a little bit of uh, message here. I3, please do not come and ask all the questions for at my site or my uh, Google account. Here is the Bible. I3, I improved tiling window manager. This is the docs. So this is the user guide. Go read the Bible. Yep, I know. I've done that two, three years ago. And then you basically know what's in there. Uh, if you want to change anything. So everything works out of the box. So the config file has been made, has been fine-tuned, has been tweaked. So it works. No problem there. So actually, it's, you start here and you read what's in there. But if you want to change and if you have a lot of questions, this is the Bible. This is where you go. All right. Um, well, so all the way down, by the way, guys, um, this is Atom. We installed Atom. We installed packages. So the package called, uh, we do it here, install package. And we should change actually the theme because this is a little bit white. Um, but later on, and we should, so we installed Pigment, which makes this thing here, and we installed Minimap in Atom, and that's why we have all these colors, which is so nice to change. So I'm going to look for, 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 for the commands that will change the gaps, and here are my gaps. So I3 caps next, for Windows Glass, border pixel 5, why not 1? How does that look? Mm -hmm. Cleaner, better, or maybe not. It's up to you. Gaps inner 10. Maybe, maybe, what if we took 5? That will save. Reload. And it looks like this. But of course, the less, I mean, the less number, uh, the, the lower the number, you won't see the wallpaper anymore. So you see it change in the background but less and less because of the border. And then maybe the look we are expecting if you're an i3 user already. And then you can do it like, like this, meaning everything is really glued together. It's, it's, this is i3. Every pixel has been filled with your uh, windows. Hmm. It's a possibility, sure it is. So we can increase them again. Let's take 5.5. Five. It's up to you. Why not take a border pixel of 2, save, and have a look again. No. Ah. Also good. So it's all okay with me. The only thing you should remember is, one, check out the Bible. This is i3w.org. Scroll down for the gaps. Here, I3 caps next, red line 739, and change at about, and then super shift R, reload it, check it if you like it. Okay, have fun.